What's up, everybody? Welcome to Loud Spot. I'm your host, Sebastian, right out of Oklahoma City. I got Weird Wolf Ava Gore joining us tonight and the Southern Flame, Don McIntyre. How are you? Hi. Good. Great. How are you? I am good. I want to kind of do a recap of this week's. We did not have an actual pre-recorded show uh, to play tonight. I kind of want to do some recap of what went on during the week, talk about some other things, and then we're going to do the live uh, acoustic show when they were over here on Saturday night, just like six days ago. It has been a fucking weird week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, think, I think it's been weird for everybody just, like, just a little bit, right? Yeah. Not, it's not just me. Great. I know for you and for Ava, too, so... On Monday, on Monday night, we had a ska band, which I love ska, and we don't get enough ska bands on this house. Pretty cool, called For the Record, where I made a bunch of dad jokes saying For the Record. <laughs> <laughs> and then, uh, and then Tuesday, Don and I were on, and there was a whole bunch of confusion over who was supposed to be on because links were kind of sent weird, and it was supposed to be the difference between uh, which wound up coming on Wednesday night. And then Ava was there for that, which threw me for a super weird loop because I was like, fuck, what do I ask them? I forgot the questions I wrote down <laughs> to, to, to ask them. <laughs> but, but I found it. And then Sue Sayer, who I, I, both nights I checked the streams. And to that band, I am sorry if you did show up and um, I wasn't there. I, I think I checked both streams both times. So maybe we'll get, I, I'm not going to put it on them. I'll put this on me just in, just in case. So, and then with the difference between Sharon's on right now, and she says ska jokes, but I will tell you that Ava, remember the question she asked where she said, tell us the difference, tell us what makes your band different? Yes. So I should have said, they're the difference between. Mm-hmm. That's what I should have said. And I didn't say it. I was like, fuck. I should have said, I think about it after the fact, you know? <laughs> and then, do what? We're going to have to start putting you in dad jokes. <laughs> I, mean, I always I, I try to make as many dad jokes as I can when I think about them on the spot. And then last night, I interviewed uh, the drummer from Hinder, which was a super fun episode. That's going to air October 1st. And, like, I totally, like, slipped my mind. I had that because I'm usually off on Thursdays. 6.30, I was like, fuck. I got to do this interview. I totally forgot. And wind up doing it. Ava asked if you could come. You were doing something I, I was think, super and- bummed because uh when I was like 13 years old I was super into that song that play an angel <laughs> and I really wanted to be there for that interview but you like called me like an hour before us was I there. know <laughs> I totally totally slipped my totally slipped my mind <laughs> so Don <laughs> wa- <laughs> Don wants to talk about why she wears sunglasses oh, for um, <laughs> on, on, on the show. So, Don, go ahead and explain why you wear sunglasses in the in like at nighttime, like in your house. Okay. What are you doing right. now? Long story short, the dog ate my fucking sunglasses instead of my homework. Seriously. And so far, um, the clinic that I've had to use since COVID has not been able to get my tent right. But I have to wear sunglasses. With some tint, just not this damn dark, um, due to um, light sensitivity. Mm-hmm. But they wind up getting my glasses too dark every time, so I wind up just rocking sunglasses until I can try to find someone else to get my tint right. So there you go. I'm extra as fuck, so you know. We're, we're <laughs> was it were you re-rapping over there? Were you doing a freestyle rap? <laughs> 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 Your wife commented, I wear my sunglasses at night. So I was singing that fucking song. Yeah. Oh, yes, yeah, she did yeah. comment. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I feel bad because. I because, am a <laughs> because when I was younger, like, you know, last year. <laughs> you know, like, like I, I remember I remember I used to like make fun of people that would wear sunglasses inside. I always was like, what the fuck? It's like, no, but you know what? They could have had a light sensitivity, and that never crossed my mind. So for anyone I made fun of without them knowing, I apologize. Dick Super move, Sebastian. Dick move. <laughs> it was. It was. It was definitely, definitely 
uh, a dick. A, you know, it's only dick would do if they knew about it. <laughs> but they did not know about it. So it's, it's, it's not that big of a deal. I also want to apologize about my internet because I freeze. Like, I go back and watch the show, and I don't freeze on my end when I'm watching. Do I freeze on your guys' end, like, a lot? Yeah, you glitch sometimes. No, I wouldn't say a lot. But, it, you know. Not a lot, but it had, does happen often. Uh, it, yeah, yeah it, it does. And, you know, I don't see it on my end, but when I go back and watch videos, I'm like, damn. So, and I swear, I, like, Ava, you asked me earlier, like, what's your internet speed? I'm like, I don't, I don't know. I, I shouldn't know. There's your things. problem. <laughs> yeah. But I know I paid for like super high expensive internet, so it doesn't do that. But then it still does that. But I think it's because I have, uh, we, since we don't have cable in the house, uh, we have, we stream all of our, which, which freaking sucks because I love football. Like I love, love, love football. And I'm not going to pay the hundred dollar package. Uh, so you're glitching now. <laughs> See, my voice is glitched, but my my oh, my. He, he didn't glitch for me. That's weird. Like, that is weird. Hands. I'll go back and watch it. I definitely <laughs> probably did glitch, uh, but I don't get the football. Uh, I'm not paying 100 bucks. If it was like a monthly breakdown, I'd probably do it. I love football. I love college football. I know ever you're like no one gives a fuck about you liking football, but I, but I like football so much that that I, I miss cable because of it. But I'm also not going to pay. You know. The outrageous price that cable is wanting to pay. Yeah, uh, want us to pay. We so. we swapped over to all apps and Wi Fi as well because of that. It was just ridiculous. The prices. So. Yeah, that's what we did, and it saved us like like the cable company kept on trying to like get me to come back. I'm like, dude, mm-hmm. if you can make all my channels like thirty bucks a month, I'll do it. Because that's what I pay for all my streaming apps is thirty bucks a month. Right. And they're yeah. like, well, we can't do that. We can charge you like seventy. I'm like, no, <laughs> thirty, thirty or, or or bust, thirty or no. So, another thing I did want to mention is I fucking hate when the sun starts going down early. Oh, my God. Me, too. It's like I love summertime hours. I hate the daylight savings thing. I'm like. So depressing. It is. Dep- and I don't mind the weather getting cooler. It's kind of a nice uh, change when the weather's It's so hot. I know it's hot in Texas, Alabama. It's hot over here. And so I don't mind the weather getting cool. I just don't like the sun. I don't like the, I wish they would just keep summertime hours like year round. Cause then I don't have to leave work at five o'clock in like January and it's dark outside. Yeah. Cause it feels like it's already time to go to sleep, you know? Yes. So anyways, all right. Last thing before we play this song is Dawn. I made a commercial for her. Uh, Well, yeah, Ava, you haven't seen it. I don't have it to play it right now. And I'm not going to put it on Facebook. And I put it on TikTok and it immediately got muted on TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> but Dawn does have a, uh, she does make, uh, what, you know, what, tell us about, tell us about your Southern Flame page. We, you know, we've interviewed Ava and her band uh, quite a few times on the show. Let's talk about um, your business and the things that you do that you sell, uh, when you're not podcasting <laughs> thank you so much that's very kind of you um i make traditional pepper jellies and then i just put my sass and spice into it so there's sweet and heat all in one and i like to do odd combinations like black cherry habanero blueberry ghost peppers um that is just different and I also sell and make jewelry, crystals, um, just odd and end things. I sell tapestries, things like that. So, yeah, and not only that, you want mailing, which I didn't know you were going to do. Three jars of different kind of jellies. <laughs> the yeah. dragon's blood is super spicy for me, anyways. My wife doesn't think it's that spicy. <laughs> I think it's spicy. Uh, and then you also mail like little, like you did my my oldest daughter, like a stone. Um, she's super into crystals and things like that. And so that's yeah. another thing you do with, with your, uh, business, right? You sell the crystals the and crystal crystals. jewelry. Yes. So are yeah. you like psychic type person? I'm empath. I'm very empathetic, highly sensitive. So. And I, you know what? I got to congratulate Ava because for the first time ever on the show, 
she clicked on a comment <laughs> and shared it. Because Ava, Ava, has, Ava has all the passwords to get on. Don, you don't have that yet, but Ava doesn't. So she can see the comments. And for the first time, she clicked on one. See, it's, <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm going to tell you, it is not easy to interview a band when I'm the only one here doing it. And then I have to read the comments. And I'll be real like, what the fuck's my problem? Like, am I airheaded? I'm like, well, I'm also reading the comments and trying to click on the comments at the same time I'm talking to the band. And it is actually really hard. It's you, not that you easy. You want me to do, do that? <laughs> yeah, you click on you click on you click on the comments. But you gotta be careful which ones you click on. Because Sharon's on here right now. Yeah, Sharon, yeah. Sometimes I don't share her shit, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sometimes I don't share I don't share her, her stuff. I'm like, man, I don't know if I'm gonna share that shit or not. Oh, good news. I ordered my mic and um, oh, good. my nice. headphones and stuff today, so I'll be more professional. <laughs> yeah, and you know, I'm like a kid now. A microphone <laughs> and headphones. Well, my microphone does suck, though. Like, Ava, Sam, I love Sam's mic. Ava has a better mic. My mic, it's almost just this much better than my uh, my computer audio. I ordered, but, I ordered but, just a basic one because I really wasn't sure what to get, but I'll know if I like it or not. It's better. It, it is. It just, I'll upgrade if I need to once I get yep. it. Yeah, and then see, Ava upgraded her, her background, which is super cool with the mm-hmm. skeleton. We talked about, about that a few times on the show. So, all right, Animal Sun was here Saturday night. Um, they came by there with, there with Sam, uh, who produces the show. He's their manager. They were on tour. And, uh, you know, I live right off the highway on I-40, so they're like, hey, we're going to stop by. And I was like, they weren't sure if they were going to. They wind up stopping by and did an acoustic show. Now, my camera does, and Sam was also on our Wi-Fi. There's two angles on this. One's from the camera for the for the podcast. The other one is Sam logged into the to the stream yard with his phone. And, of course, I'm in the background on my phone also. I probably, I, I, looking back, I probably should just let them do that. But I was like, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Like, my house, I'm going to do what I want to do. My house, my rules. My house, my rules, my podcast. You come to my house, that's right. We play by what I feel like saying. I don't care what anyone else has to say. <laughs> my show. Animal Sun, Big Press. Yes, they are awesome. Okay, so here is uh, them doing a live acoustic show at the house. Here we go. All right, what's up, everybody? It's Sebastian from the last spot. We got Animal Sun in the building. Woo! I'm going to stand Take it away and take over the show, brother. Come play your songs. This is Stephen Blake of Animal Sun. You got the, right here. We got the boys right here, and uh, we're taking up a loud spot. We're going to play our new single uh, from the album just came out. Uh, this song is called Every Word. Hope you guys enjoy it. One, two, three, Look at you cheesing. <laughs> Down in my heart, and just to feel that I'm sane, taking it every time. I play this game, tell myself that I'm fine. Every move you make, I'll fake it when I can't relate to you. I'm the one to 
performance for you guys. It's called really every word. Good. <laughs> 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 there you go. And what's up with their song? Every word. Look, I will, and you know, I have a live reaction um, thing that's at the bottom. And I have that because I don't have anything. I didn't know what else to uh, put for tonight. So, so I put that one on. <laughs> <laughs> that was really good. I bet that was a lot of fun having them there. It, it was. They seem like they're a lot of fun. Yeah, they could. They stopped, They finally stopped by around like 11 p.m., maybe a little after 11. And so it was cool. They came to that live performance, and then they, they bounced out. They had other places to go and mm-hmm. people to see do another concert. I will tell you there was one time where I stepped on. So for anyone that doesn't know what the rest of the podcast room looks like, that's what it looks like. It's like a couch. Yeah. And then like just the block with the poster behind me is just for the background and everything else. It just looks kind of not as cool. <laughs> not as cool as that. <laughs> but there was one time where I stepped on the couch and I was behind the, the guy that's playing an acoustic bass. And the keyboardist is right there next to on the other side of the couch that I'm standing on. And I was about to step down between the guy playing the bass and the keyboard and try to walk in between to get closer to where Sam was so I wasn't in his shot. And I knew if I did that, I would like probably fall because I had been drinking and I would like ruin the whole thing. And like I knocked the keyboard over. So I decided to not do that. <laughs> so. Whenever, whenever bands on tour and they want to stop by after coming down I forty through Oklahoma, let me know. We can always do an acoustic show. I think they're super fun. They're cool. Um, I like I said, it's just kind of something neat that bands can do if they're, if they're on tour. I live in Oklahoma, so it's like the middle of America. I love stripping music down to it's an acoustic. Yeah, <laughs> it's cool, right? It, it, sound, it sounds different. It's not so produced, and you get to hear the raw, like almost the raw talent of a band. Right Without now. all the glam behind it. Yeah, me and Raph started out as a acoustic. So. Yeah, and then why, why did you guys switch? Uh, I mean, did you, I guess you probably assumed you were always going to make the switch, maybe, maybe not. Uh, well, yes. Our produced versions of the songs were electronic, but when it came to playing live, we hadn't figured out how to, like, get that sound that you wanted. Yeah. And so it was just a lot easier for us to play the acoustic because, you know, that's how they're written anyway. We, um, they start yeah, out yeah. acoustic and then. Yeah. All your songs start out acoustic? Uh, pretty much, yeah. That's cool. I didn't know that. It's pretty neat. I guess, you know, I don't think about those things. I don't think about those things. <laughs> Ava, yeah. I have to tell you, I watched the video with um, you guys in your newest one. And I was mm-hmm. like, that is not fucking Ava, really? <laughs> no way! Your personality in person, and then seeing you on camera, I was like, "Okay, she just totally dropped everything." It was like, "Okay, here I am." So that was impressive. That was Thank amazing. you. That was great. I do want to say to Sharon, who says hi, Anna. My wife goes by Stacia, <laughs> and, not, and not Anna. <laughs> that happens a lot. That happens a lot to her. People call her Anna. She's like, "It's Stacia." Hey, Stacia. <laughs> <laughs> but, but she does do people do call her Anna a lot and uh you know I told her I was gonna start doing that and I never did because she gave me the stink eye. Like, you, better, you, better, you better not do that. So. I'm gonna throw punch you later. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, said, oh my god, that reminds me of the commercial I made for you. <laughs> I did say throw punch in that in that deal with some other uh, <laughs> I need to see this commercial. <laughs> Oh, you know what, Ava? I'll send. I'll send it to you. I'll send it to you. It's, always, it's like it's meant to be funny, and then it kind of sounds like he's insulting me, but at the same time, it's he's not. So I'm like, uh, I don't know whether to take that as a compliment or just, just let the just we'll just let it speak for itself. I was done. I was rolling. <laughs> Ava, do you weigh 90 pounds? No. <laughs> you weigh 93 pounds. Uh, I'm no. just kidding. Uh, I'm definitely in the triple digits. <laughs> Some people hate that. See, don't you like clicking on the comments and then click on that one my wife just put up there? Stacia or Anastasia, but it is all good in the hood. <laughs> So, and anyways, that's all I really got tonight. It's it's, it's so different when you're not interviewing a band. That's what I'm used to doing. Uh, is talking to bands. There's always kinds of kinds of questions you can um, ask bands, I guess. And I've gotten way good at just fucking winging it and coming unprepared. 
100% unprepared for the show. I was unprepared, kind of unprepared for the Hinder show. Uh, wind up being a pretty good show, and it was super fun. So October 1st is when that is going to air, and we are going to promote it. Ava, I will send you that commercial, and you will see why TikTok silenced it right away. So, that, okay. think, you know what, Ava? You, so you know this. Maybe, maybe you do. I'm on Patreon, right? So the loud spot, you know, patreon.com forward slash loud spot to give me all your money. Um, I don't know how to uh, put, I don't know if you can put videos on there. Is it just pictures? Yeah, you can put videos on there. You can? Yeah. I'll have to go through and try to figure it out. I tried it on my phone through the app and it just, I couldn't, it didn't. Oh, the app, is, the app is useless. Oh, the app. Okay. So the app sucks. You got to yeah. do it on the computer. Mm-hmm. Oh, that means I got to email it to myself. Maybe I'll put it on the. I'll put it on our Patreon page. So yeah. hard. I'm lazy. I think I'm lazy. I still want to figure it out, man. I like doing everything from my app. I hate even having to get on a computer. If I could do this from my phone app, it'd be so much better. Oh, hey, Don. Hi. There, there's there's Turtle. Hi. He commented that he's watching, so that's awesome. <laughs> All right. Well, this is the Lost Spot crew right here. Mine is Sam. He's, uh, I don't know what he's doing. I'm still on the road or what he's doing tonight, but I texted him. He has not texted me back. But um, I love what we have going on. So thank the both of you. I thank Sam for being part of the show. We're going to keep this thing going. I can't wait to see what like we do in October and November. This, we've only, I've only been doing this a year, a little over a year, and we've grown quite a bit. So I think everyone who supports us and like i said patreon.com forward slash loud spot youtube just type in the loud spot um on facebook i was surprised that how many people that were my own family members did not like the page my wife sent a bunch of invites i'm like oh your brother just liked it now and then i'm like <laughs> come on dudes i invited you guys like support a year ago am. <laughs> support us support us support us. Hey, listen, you guys have anything else or is that it not good that was thank it. you for having me Absolutely. Of course. Uh, yes. Both of you guys, I enjoy on the show. So, all right, that's it. Peace out. Rock on. Much love. Good night. This is the loud spot outro by nothing short of tragic. Is this all talk with no action? No. Is this my thoughts with distraction? No. Is this what I bought that's in fashion? Or is this the loud spot with Sebastian? Yes. Does nothing short of tragic have his back again? Yes. Everything that's good really has to end. A pin post has a pin show, so to get more episodes, make an order. This is over. Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to click the like and share button. Don't forget to go to our YouTube and subscribe. If you want to listen to our audio and pick up some cool merch, go to www.theloudspot.net. Peace out, rock on, much love.